We all use it. It adds taste to our food, and without it, our wintry roads would be ice rinks. However, our need for salt is far greater than this. It is a basic element in almost everything around us. Just about everything we touch was made with the help of salt. Consider, for example, plastic, or glass, or medicines. Frisian salt is sourced from deep within the Earth's crust. Once the salt is removed, soil subsidence occurs, which affects the water regime. To make sure our beautiful Frisian landscape retains its agricultural wealth, fields are drained, ditches widened, or pumps installed. A sustainable method on land. An even more sustainable method is extracting salt from the deep subsoil below the seabed. Think of it as digging a hole on the beach. As soon as the tide rises, the hole very quickly disappears. A self-restoring mechanism that is well managed. This ensures that the feeding and resting areas for birds and other wooden sea animals are preserved. Water is pumped into the salt at around 3 kilometers below ground level. This dissolves the salt, which is then brought to the surface as brine. Many kilometers of piping deliver the brine to a large basin near the factory. The brine goes through the first large reactor tanks. These remove the calcium and magnesium, among other things. The brine is then put through five evaporation phases. Thin pipes run through the evaporation installations, surrounded by hot steam. The brine is brought to the boil, leaving behind the salty mush. The evaporated moisture from the boiling process is captured for reuse as steam in each of the evaporation phases. The clean hot water is used to make steam for the processing phase, as well as for pumping it into the deep underground to return as brine. The salty mush from the evaporation installations moves on to the centrifuges. Here the salt is separated from the remaining brine. Part of this salt is transported on conveyor belts to an enormous storage facility, from where it is directly transported to, for example, the chemical industry. The remaining salt is used in food or animal feed. It is also used for making salt tablets and blocks used for water softening. The laboratory continuously carries out research to ensure the superior quality of the salt is maintained. This is to guarantee pure and clean salt. Here in Friesland, the salt comes from deep underground and is already very pure. Pure salt, a source for growth and life. <laughs>